Welcome back. It's been a whole month since coming back to Florida. The cleansing my mind and soul had during the last trip has given me a different perspective, like I said in my last video. The universe has thrown multiple curveballs trying to get me back into the same negative and draining headspace I was in recently. But I've been open to the failures and setbacks as they have guided me to the correct path every time without me even trying. The quote from Ram Dass has been repeating in my mind all week, so it's naturally become the new mantra. It is important to expect nothing, to take every experience, including the negative ones, as merely steps on the path and to proceed. It's very easy to get caught up in everything negative happening in our lives, but it's up to us to how we react to it. Will we grow, blossom, and overcome, or allow the negativity to be the salt in the soil forever? The adventures this week took my dad and I to a local farm in Alberta, Alabama. It went from city to farmlands within minutes and the drive was absolutely serene. We arrived at Hillcrest Farms a little after 7 a.m. It was a feeling of coming home. Hillcrest Farms is bountiful with orchards of many different varieties of fruit trees and the local favorites, of course, the scuppernong and muscadine grapes. Seeing their family farm gave me so much life and when we left, I had a warm, fuzzy feeling in my soul. How funny. Look at these babies. We got the feed. There was a feeling of walking in heaven with how the sun was glistening through the trees up high and showering glittering rays of sunlight on the rows of blueberries and grapes down below. There's an organized harvesting schedule, so you know exactly when to come back for your favorites. I'm most definitely looking forward to the persimmons in the fall. Only that and you, which is me, can hear what I'm saying. In whatever kind of way, it doesn't matter how I feel. 
or if what hurts me don't seem too real they lift me up through thick and thin until i lift my chin and give them a grin Beautiful. I definitely love to know what the berries come to, so we okay. can uh, just so we yeah, can spend a little the, more. Just bring me the bag in. Yeah? Absolutely. Yeah. To be called honey. This is beautiful. My wife makes all the beef, beef wax products and the These are beautiful. Somebody, somebody had one in her in a beef club and they tried it and it didn't work like. My mom's 93 and it's her farm, so we're taking care of her and trying to That's make beautiful. A That's beautiful. I love yeah. all of this. So what do the berries come to exactly? 885. 885? That yes. is it? That's it. Okay, Dad, we have to get a little bit more. Just a little bit He's more. It's got mustard and onion in it. It's, a, it's all habaneros except for the spices and the onions. You know it's going to be. But it's very tasty. The is, is really popular one. So. Beautiful. You guys are doing what we want to do. Yes. Try to get back to earth again. And here's, we'll have citrus in the fall. Absolutely. Some sassimas and kumquats and... Persimmons. Persimmons, as well. yes. We're coming for some persimmons. Get the ready, The usually first of August. First of August. Okay, yes. Dad, for you the bag. There you go. He's right. getting his knee done, let's see, next week. So we'll be back in the fall for sure your to be picking one, more. Your first knee to be done? Yeah, oh. I got this in here six weeks afterwards, so. Uh, yeah. I'm good with that. Which one did you want? This very big one? Yeah. Got it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, it just It goes fine. this way, because if you don't, it'll be rolling back and forth like that. That is ginormous. So 38 <laughs> pounds, huh? Oh my gosh, thank you very much. You're very welcome. Have a good weekend. Yes. And we will see you again. We will be back. Right. We will definitely be back. Thank, thank you. you. If you are in a pinch of time and you have 40 minutes, try this out. As long as you add that baking powder, you can add any other seasonings to that and it will come out crispy as ever. 20 minutes on one side, flip it, 20 minutes on the next. Easy peasy. Then when you pull them out, add any of your favorite marinades, sauces, whichever. Roll them in that, boom, your wings are done.
he came out pretty sweet. I hope together we can shift our perspective on negativity and things not going our way and trying our best to be carefree and always expecting things to go wrong. Sadly, oddly, I hope you understand me. probably always sound like a broken record at the end, but I really do hope that you are well. Even if I don't know who you are, it may be faceless at this moment, even if it is few. I just want to thank you for watching from the bottom of my heart. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you next time.